everyone, welcome to my nookery. My name's Linda and today we are on podcast 77. Wow. So I've got um, a few whips that I want to share with you today. Um, the first one is um, my blankets for the challenges and uh, I hope you watched last night with Ursula, Jeannie and V. Unfortunately I'm away when um, with my my Rick so I've done the five months now I've got another five months to do and I will put pictures at the end of this um, this podcast so you can see them properly um, so this is the Casablanca and um, I'm really um, enjoying the pattern it's really nice um, I know there's the Indiana and um, there's another one as well that you do different patterns but I wanted something that would continue you know and I really do like that one so there's that one and for that I am using I am using um, Derry Moore's studio this is oatmeal and I've got turquoise, both Derrimores, and this is my um, subscriber blanket. I'm not no. I've got to think of something really to, uh, nice to call it. So when I cuddle myself in this, I know I'm going to be surrounded by love from all my subscribers. So thank you. So that's that blanket. And then the next one is going to replace this blanket next year. This is the Queen, Queen Cow. And I, I love this one. This is, for me, this is my favourite. This is my favourite. And I'm doing it in um, raspberry and grey. But if you can see the grey has got kind of flecks of green, like blossom. And I'm really liking that. And for this, again, I'm using, um, let me get me, um, I'm, on both of the blankets, I'm using four millimetre clover hooks. So the raspberry is Derrimore's Studio Anti Pilling. And you can get this yarn from um, Lovecrafts. And this is the Hayfield Baby Blossom. So they're the two blankets that I've done. So um, I've just got five more months to do. And um, then November and December I'm going to be doing the borders. So that's that. The other thing that I'm doing is I'm doing the, um, the Granny Poncho Cow 2022 with um, designed by Selena Backer. And I'm using for this, I'm actually using the um, Hobie Carnival yarn. And what you have to do is you have to do, what have I done? Eight, eight granny squares. And um, I've just found out what we're going to do next. So I'll do that, I'll get that done. So I've done two of them. And I really like it. And what I've done is to sh so I know which is the front and which is the back. I put um, a stitch marker in one of the squares so I know that that is the front and that is the back of the granny square. So I've done two of them, both different, which is what I wanted. So as you can see, so I'm really excited to get them done. And again, stitch marker in the beginning of the face of the face granny stitch. The second one, is, um, the next work in progress. I've got no finished projects for you to do today. I'm working in the background on organising and sorting out um, next month um, for my channel um, and that's so I've been working quietly in the background so this is the anchor granny square shrug so I'm working on that and I'm using um, ice yarns linen 
which is 50% viscose, 50% linen. There's 50 grams, 175 meters, and it's a three millimeter hook. And am I using it as my hook in here? Oh dear. And that is the square. So I've done two of them so far, so I've got another 13 to do. So that's that, that's what I'm working on. And I need to find my hook, guys. My hook's gone walkabout. I have to see if I can find it. Not good, is it? And this is my um, base that holds all my um, 3.5 Oh dear. My um, my book's gone walkabouts, guys. It's a three point five in there. It's a three point five three. Oh dear, I've lost my book. I've lost my book, guys. Which isn't very good because I need my three millimeter book. I'll have to sort that out and see if I can find it. Not good, guys idiot that I am and then the last thing that I'm working on it's not, not, hold on I found it I found it that was a bit so the next thing I'm working on I'm working on my beach cover up and I'm using a 3.5 hook just pop that there and I'm using a combination of ice yarn, what's it called, Camilla Cotton Magic. This is 100% mercerized, 100 grams, 260 meters, 3 millimeter hook. And I'm using the silky, um, mere silky. Um, for the top and I've just started let me get my hook forgot to put my crochet hook in the so I've just started the top bit now let me just do this so I can I need to put my where's my um, I need my stitch marker it's all the way down here right okay so this is what I'm taking away with me to do in the car <laughs> while we're traveling. So this is what I've done so far. So I'm now up to, obviously guys, I don't want it right the way down to my knees. I kind of want it mid thigh. Well, about that much from my knee. So we'll see. Uh, anyway, um, and I am planning hopefully to do a tutorial on this. So I call it my four in a bed stitch. <laughs> Cause the four in a bed look four, four, four. <laughs> so this is my four in a bed stitch, and I've started. So when this yarn is, when this is fini finished, one side will be finished. So be, I'm going to. I wanted to get one side finished face so I could show you what one side looks like and it, it all depends on your measurements and um, you can add to it I will tell you the stitch count and the multiples and then it's up to you um I've got a hair sorry guys I've got a hair it's driving me nuts and then it's entirely up to you how you um how you go about making it um, I've got a few ideas on finishing and, and that, so we'll see how that goes. Okay, so that yeah, they, are, they are my whips, so that is going with me when I go away. I'm going to take um, something else with me as well, because I like to do, you know, two different things. Um, I want to thank each and every one of my new subscribers um, for joining my family, my YouTube family. Thank you. Welcome. I hope you enjoy. If you've got any ideas on what you would like to see on my channel, then please leave a comment. Um, and um, 
<clears throat> don't forget guys uh, thumbs up comment share my videos out to your friends and uh, that would be awesome i want to thank everybody um in my last podcast i asked you kindly if you had community tabs if you would give me a shout out on your community tabs i do appreciate those who have done it thank you so much from the bottom of my heart thank you thank you thank you i'm trying to reach my next goal of five thousand subscribers so thank you all so very much for your support and and everything and um, I hope you're all having a fabulous time I'm not back now until Wednesday I'll be back for my live on Wednesday which I think is either the 1st or 2nd of June hmm I think it's the 1st of June actually guys I do I do believe it's the 1st of June so yeah guys so if you can um, like subscribe and possibly share my this uh, podcast out I would be so grateful but once again welcome to all my subscribers thank you so much to all my long-standing subscribers I do really so appreciate you all every single one of you and uh, I think that's all from me for today Take care, guys. Stay safe. But more importantly, as I always say, be kind to you. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.